Hello, my dear friends. Greetings to you in Jesus' name. Trying to slow or even reverse aging has been the quest of mankind ever since the beginning. In our current culture, we are witnessing an explosion in the anti-aging market. According to a market research, an anti-aging market is poised to surge from around $150 billion a year in 2015 to more than $200 billion a year by the year 2021. As the baby boomer generation are coming into retirement, or the retirement age, more and more people are spending more money trying to stay young. Even the younger generations are trying to stay young themselves. But do you know that the scripture also gives incredible insights into how we can all stay young without spending tons of money on cosmetic, plastic surgery, or even those health supplements that promise miracles? In Proverbs chapter 14, verse 30, we read that a tranquil heart gives life to the flesh. The phrase gives life is translated from the Hebrew word hay, H-A-Y, which is often translated as reviving or rejuvenating. In other words, a tranquil heart can actually rejuvenate your flesh. Do you know that a stressful and a disturbed heart not only contribute to cardiovascular diseases or heart problems, but has also been found to contribute to many different types of skin disease such as the flesh-eating disease? Conversely, a tranquil or peaceful heart had been credited to help slow down or even reverse deterioration of heart condition or other sicknesses. So. Instead of spending tons of money to stay young, perhaps you should also consider the powerful prescription of the Word of God that tells us to pursue tranquility and peace. For me, I can attest to the fact that ever since the Lord has led this church to pursue rest, I have noticed that I felt younger, more energized, and rejuvenated. These days, I often hear people telling me that I'm looking younger than when they first met me. It's true that I'm more diligent in taking care of myself through diet and exercise, but I also strongly believe that the biggest contributor to my younger look is that pursuit of rest. In a place of rest, my heart had grown more at peace and tranquil. Friends, we are all very busy people. There are thousands of things that are competing for our time every single day. And there will always be thousands of things competing for our time in our lifetime. It is up to us to prioritize who or what we expend our time on. In your endeavor to improve the quality of your life while on earth, may I suggest that you put the pursuit of the tranquility of the heart one of your top priorities. In Psalms chapter 103 verse 5, we are told that God wants to satisfy our years with good things so that our youth is renewed like an eagle. One of those good things is a tranquil heart. It's there for the taking. Don't let anything or anyone rob you of their blessings. Well, thanks for watching. If you're in town, I hope to see you at church this weekend. Otherwise, may the Lord richly bless you and your family.